All right, so here it is. First details on Harrison Ford's recast Marvel character revealed. This is coming straight from the direct guys. This article was fresh. It's published an hour ago. This is what you get whenever you are subscribed to the weekly wrap ups YouTube channel. You get news that drops like immediately and I give it to you. So, you know, so you're informed. That's like one of the goals on the channel. So here's the here's the news. Here it is. After being one of the biggest action stars in the industry for decades, Harrison Ford is about to take on another major franchise with a role in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Recently, it was confirmed that Han Solo slash Indiana Jones star will be taking over the role of General Thaddeus Thunderbolt Ross with his tenure starting in 2024's Captain America New World Order. Uh, filling in the shoes of the late William Hurt in the MCU, Ford will bring a new flair to General Ross and Captain America 4 as Anthony Mackie. Sam Wilson works to find his true place as the new Star Spangled Avenger. Ford's character could potentially serve as an ally or an enemy for Wilson on this new outing, even though the leading hero will already have his hands full with Tim Blake's Nelson's return as the leader. With Captain America 4 uh, still more than a year and a half away from its release, of course, more of the details about Ford's role will remain a mystery as Marvel Studios continues Sam Wilson's journey. But now, fans may have their first idea of what to expect thanks to a new rumor revealing potential plot details for the pre prenuptial one movie in Phase 5. His role fleshed out. Okay. It's pretty yeah, it's pretty dope. I think there I, mean, I think that was a pretty good um casting decision there, casting choice. So a new rumor from the cat from the cosmic circus teased how Captain America New World Order will bring back General Thaddeus um General Thunderbolt Ross, now played by Harrison Ford. Portly Ross will now be a private citizen in the MCU, having left his days. Uh, as the United States Secretary of State behind him. However, he'll likely still have his connections to the military and other powerful forces planning for his own new world. Ooh, interesting. No details were revealed about um, where Thunderbolt Ross's alliances, or I'm sorry, allegiances lie in terms of the hero or villain in the MCU. Wow. It's good stuff, guys. Goes on talking about how his role will fit in Captain America 4. The last time we saw fan, fan saw him, he was part of the A-list crowd attending Tony Stark's funeral in Avengers Endgame, of course, after just being seen ordering a court martial of the Earth's mightiest heroes in Avengers Infinity War. And now it appears that he'll, uh, he'll be leaving uh, his government days in the rearview mirror. That doesn't mean that his presence in the story will lessen by any means. Considering his own ties to Tim Blake Nelson's leader from 2008's Incredible Hulk, Ross's um, allegiances could truly end up on either side of the fight. On the one hand, he could decide to turn over a new leap, new leaf, and help out Sam Wilson and the company, and uh, by giving them insight into what um, Samuel Stearns could do with a dose of Bruce Banner's blood having leaked into his brain. But on the other hand, he could use the leader for his own nefarious ambitions, going to the going to the villain to upgrade himself physically and take on his Red Hulk persona from the comics. No matter what side of the equation he ends up on, Ross's return in Captain America 4 will be one that fans um, eyes open, especially uh, with him being played by a pop culture icon like Harrison Ford, of course, absolutely. Only time will tell if he moves on to Thunderbolts following his appearance, disappearance, I should say, in the sequel, which would most likely make him even more powerful and dangerous in the future. Captain America New World Order debuts May 3rd, 2024. There it is, guys. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff.